If you move to System, Feature Visibility, and enable the Advanced Policy Options, you will see that your policy page will change a bit. Let's just look at my policy. You can have, uh, you can actually configure the ID of the policy. You can negate sources, and if you scroll down, you will see that you have advanced options. Now, if you use your command line with config system settings, you can enable another feature, which is the TCP session without SIM. Let's just enable it. And let's refresh our page. And here we have it. Allow TCP session without SIM. What does it mean? Coming up. If you're enabling TCP session without SIM on your policy, then you're actually doing something quite unique. That is, your 48 usually has a session time to live of 3600 seconds. So that's the default. You can change it, of course, but that's the default. Each session in the session table will live for that period of time. Now, what happens if your client initiates a session towards a database server or any server and the session will take much more longer than 3600? Now, if your server comes back on that specific session and this session was already deleted from the session table, then the packets will be dropped. And that's the idea. If you disable SYN checking for packets that belong to the same session, then you can actually avoid disruptions in your network and the traffic or the packets won't drop.